Hi, I'm Richard Byrne. In this video, I'm going to show you four ways that you can quickly remove the background from your images. Let's go ahead and take a look at the first option, which is one that's probably been right under your nose for a while, and that is right in PowerPoint. So here I am in PowerPoint. Let's go ahead and insert an image, and I'm going to pick one that's on my computer. Here it is. I'm going to use this one of myself skiing, and I want to remove the background. So you'll notice that I now have this remove background option right here. Let's click on it, and I'll show you something kind of interesting about it. I can go over here to the left hand side and mark areas to keep. So if I want to keep a little bit more of my lower body here i can do that by just highlighting that area that i want to keep i want to keep this area that has my backpack in it as well so there it is and now let's keep those changes and we'll see there's my new image with the background removed and now i can put something else in the background in place of that perhaps i want to put myself on the beach wearing my ski helmet and goggles, I could do that right here in PowerPoint. So that's the first option. The second option is a tool called photoscissors.com, and I've previously highlighted this on my blog. Just go to Upload Image, and let's pick that picture again. And we're going to see that it's going to now remove the background and just like in powerpoint if i want to touch it up a little bit i can go over here and do some more erasing and over here i can erase even more granularly and if i like it let's just go ahead and hit download and i'm going to download that in a low resolution the low resolution is fine for most situations, but if you need a high resolution copy, Photo Scissors does require that you pay for that. Now, a third option is one that's built into Adobe Creative Cloud Express, formerly known as Adobe Spark. So if you used Adobe Spark in the past and you're wondering what happened to it, it's now called Adobe Creative Cloud Express, and they have a background remover. Let's go to the Quick Actions section, select image and choose remove background and then you can upload the image that you want to remove the background from and we'll see as soon as that's done oh that's a really accurate job that it does if you do need to customize it you can but let's hit that download button and now i have a high resolution copy that I can use wherever I would like. And the last option, the fourth option for removing backgrounds from your images is in Canva. Now in Canva, you will have to first select a template and you can use any of the templates. It could be an Instagram template, a website template, a YouTube template, it doesn't matter what template it is. You need to first pick a template for the sake of simplicity, I'm going to use a blank Instagram post. And then I'm going to upload a picture. So let's upload some media here. And I'll use this one again. And then we'll drop that one onto the template canvas. And I'm going to expand it a little bit center it up and then go to edit image and you can remove the background with just one click and when it's done we'll see that that background is gone and there I am with my ski helmet and goggles on and let's apply that and you'll see there's some other image editing options we could use including adjusting the brightness contrast using some of these filters here we could even go into the face retouch and if we want to smooth our skin whiten our teeth or reduce red eye although with my goggles on 
So not any red eye to worry about. And we can apply that as well. So those are four ways you can quickly and easily remove the background from your images. As always, for more things like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com or subscribe to my YouTube channel.